Friends and family, I would like you to check out blackcommunityspeak.com. Now, blackcommunityspeak.com is a forum based website. So, something that's very simple where you can get on, you can get off, you know, get involved with a lot of topics. Now, Black Community Speaks is a place that's for black men and women to talk about issues that's affecting the entire community. So, on blackcommunityspeak.com, they talk about topics in the range of news, uh, what's going on in society, relationships, technology, business, food and recipes, gaming, health and fitness, you know, music and many, many more. Um, on Black Community Speak, it's a place where you can be safe to say what you want to say without the fear of big tech censorship. So make sure you head on over to blackcommunityspeak.com and sign up today. Hello everyone, it's me, Demetra K of The Demetra K Show here on YouTube and a proud contributor of the African Diaspora News Channel. If you could please do me a favor and subscribe to all channels and like this video, I would greatly appreciate it. So as you guys know, it is election season, the midterms are coming up and now black people are really starting to wake up and say, hey, wait a minute now, why should I go to the booth and vote for Democrats anymore because we have got nothing specifically as we know the Democrats own the House, the Senate, and the presidency, but yet they keep saying they can't get anything done for us. But in the same vein, they're doing things for everybody else. And so somebody by the name of Bishop Talbert Swan, I'm sure you guys know a lot about him. He asked some pretty important questions, I think. So I want to read it to you. So he says, Asians, you get a hate crime bill. Jews, you get a hate crime resolution. LGBT, you get a hate crime bill. Ukrainians, you get $40 billion. Black people, just be patient and don't forget to vote for us in the midterm election. And so, is he lying? Is that not how it's gone so far, especially with, you know, Biden being at the helm there in the White House as the Democratic president with the Democratic Congress? Black people have to be told, just wait and be patient. It's coming. Oh, well, this, that, and the other. And so there's some Negroes that got under uh, Bishop Swan's post and gave him a little pushback. And one of the people said this, Joe Biden signs anti-lynching bill in historic first. So of course you guys know Joe Biden signed the Emmett Till anti-lynching bill. And so for whatever reason, people are thinking, well, that's something for black people. Well, can I ask y'all a question? Is it just black people that can be lynched or can anybody be lynched? I would think anybody can be lynched. And so does that bill say, hey, black people, this is yours. This is specifically for you. If anybody else get lynched, this bill won't benefit them. It's just for you. It doesn't say that, does it? No, it doesn't. Okay, so somebody else said this. Just curious, have you read the hate crime bill? I read it again this morning, even though it says anti-Asian, the bill is for us too. I'm starting to notice that lawmakers are making bills that benefit black people, but if it says specifically that, they know it won't pass. And so, okay, so they can say specifically for Asians and anybody else, but they can't say black. Is that like a taboo word or something? Like, why can't they say this is specifically for black people? You know who else says something like that? That was Kamala. Well, she says, I'm not just going to pass anything that's specifically for black people. No, that's what those talking points come from, right? So we got to be incognito, right? We can't really be out front and say, hey, we want a bill for us because what, they won't like it? Who is this they? Other people? Other people are getting bills with their names on us, so we should be able to get one too. All right, so another Negro jumped on the post and said this, Dems don't really have a Senate majority and can't get anything passed. Republicans always block it. We must get a true Democratic majority to pass a bill like that. That this is why understanding how government works and voting is very important. Sitting back and doing nothing achieves nothing. So there's that lie again. Oh, well, the, the Republicans are blocking and they won't let the Democrats do anything because, you know, if it wasn't for the Republicans, well, why is everybody else getting something? So you mean to tell me that the Republicans just hate black people? Which some of them might, I'm not saying they don't. But are you telling me that black is the word that you cannot use because it will get blocked? And so these sleepy Negroes that got under Bishop Swan's post trying to refute what he was saying, they're the ones that drink the Kool-Aid of the Democratic Party. And that's why it's very important 
for us, especially in new black media and y'all too who watch these videos to get out there and educate people about what the Democrats are not doing for black people and what they are doing for everybody else and tell them, don't fall for the okie doke during the midterm election and say here and that, oh, well, you know, if we don't vote, then the Republicans are going to get in there and then things are going to be worse. Like, worse how? How much worse can it really be for us than it is right now, right? So get out there, spread the word and say, don't you take yourself in that booth and vote for these Democrats because they say vote blue no matter who. Think very long and hard about the people you're going to vote for. Think about the people who are in office now, including the Congressional Black Caucus. They do stuff for everybody else but black people. And so I think black people need to finally say, eh, well, let them go vote for you. We're going to sit it out and maybe just have a V8. I don't know. Y'all tell me. So anyway, for more insightful commentary, please subscribe to this channel and my channel, The Demetri K Show, here on YouTube. Peace. Hello, everyone. Please make sure you subscribe to the African Diaspora News Channel app on these platforms.